So here at MSU, we treat a lot of common injuries about the shoulder, hip, knee, elbow, ankle, things like ACL injuries, shoulder dislocations, hip impingement, patellar instability, and a variety of fractures. Um, our non-operative sports medicine colleagues, they see a lot more of the common injuries like muscle strains, ligament sprains, tendon injuries, and other overuse injuries. We see a lot of sports injuries with your contact sports, things like football, wrestling, ice hockey, lacrosse, or basketball, for example. But even your non-contact sports like running, swimming, tennis, golf, or volleyball can result in injuries too. It's not always easy to know when to seek treatment, so we can certainly see you and help develop a plan that's going to get you back out there doing the things you want to do and performing at your best. There are some simple steps people can take such as stretching before and after playing a sport or working out and even staying hydrated before, during and after activity. Uh, another important thing to do is to cross train. So even if someone's an avid runner or a casual weekend tennis player, uh, it's important to diversify your conditioning and make sure all parts of your body are getting attention so that you're not overstressing any one particular area. Mm -hmm.